Hey guys, Joshua Peterson, Peterson Electric. Uh, just want to show you some retrofitting of some LED lighting in here in a barn. Uh, it's January 2019. And uh, some people get really worried about the hay in the barn. I, I couldn't tell you how much dust came off of these covers. They had these old um, 96 inch basically eight foot, 110 watt high output T8 tubes, and those things were not doing well. Um, so one thing you keep in mind is if you got out the ballast, you could just use the frame itself to screw to it and drill through it, put your nipple and make sure your, your covers are secure with some self tappers. Um, is it the prettiest thing in the world? No, but this guy piped in and out of both sides of the fixture and she rather had us pipe new legs off of that uh, to give her more lighting extended rather than just screwing uh, two four footers right to that so or redoing all that piping so anyways we put in some leds are like six inches or eight inches by a one a four foot um they are very high output lumen cool in color and we piped all of this up there and through um we did not do any of this so please don't waste my time with asking me about did you gfi the outlets we're gonna get some um tighter niche covers for them, at least some WRs on there and some GFCIs and bigger boxes later. But for right now, they had no light with their horses, so we just wanted to get the lights done this year and next year we'll focus on that. But again, a lot of this was already done about probably 20 years ago, so. Um, but yeah, so, you know, expanding off, we used some just simple J hooks to nail on there. Love using those J hooks, half inch EMT pipe. Um, you know, about this, about a day's worth of a job. Um, material, these are, are gonna be a seal tight fixture. I would only suggest that. Uh, though with LED, I mean, you're going from such a high output of a spark on a huge magnetic ballast. It's old school advanced. And now you're going into something so simple as a very light fixture. The fixture's way lighter than those things alone. So anyway, so just give you a quick view in the backup so you can see it all. But yeah, I love doing these type of jobs with the barns and all the pipe and offsetting it. So um, yeah, anyways, give us a call if you have any questions on that. Um, as far as pricing, you know, it's hard to tell you that just because lights at times end up being different cost, um, especially through the years. Uh, especially sometimes I can't get them cheaper than somebody else, but usually we go through uh, Rab or Lithonia, some of the stuff that I like. So anyways, thanks for joining us.